20 XLD pilot house. That's a deep V pilot house for rough ocean water. Massive 96 beam, nice windless anchor, bow pulpit, and uh, nice stainless bow rail all the way around. Your windows open all the way up, as you see. Get some nice air through the cockpit. Good dead rise on the front entry. Let's take a look at the other side. Twin 300s, I like to order this boat with. Comes with a nice big bracket. Which is great for fishing. Getting behind it. If you look at how everything's fit and finished around here, there's no cracks in the hull. Uh, your molding is nice and clean. There's not a big gap of caulk all the way around like some of the competitors do. Uh, very unclean looking cracks that are come on a brand new boat. Uh, gel coat cracks, nothing like that from Parker. I wanted a 95% quality control boat. Look at the bracket, there's no ugly caulking or bad beating all the way around like many of the competitors as I said. Recess trim tabs come automatically. Walk through transom door, something a lot of guys don't have either. Makes it nice and easy to get on. Look at the cockpit room on this boat for fishing. It's a fishing machine. I like to do the second station on a lot of these boats. You could also get this boat with the whole back off of it and curtains. Um, the doors are really, really nice. Big window, seals all the way to the door. On a 28, 25, there's barely a step down, small one. But you know, what that does is these, these boats are actually molded in from the factory. Pilot house is molded in and built into the boat. If you have a flat deck and your pilot house is on top and your pilot house is too tall, it's gonna be top heavy. And to be honest with you, it's gonna be bolted in, not molded into the, to the, to the boat. So some of the competitors make their boats that way. <clears throat> this is the top selling boat in the country. Uh, they sell the most pilot houses by far. LED spreader lights, rocket launchers, double trumpet horn. Many guys give you no, no horn or they break. Very cheap horns. There's a double trumpet stainless horn, which is really nice. Grab rails on the top. Uh, one of the strongest hard tops. Uh, some of the other guys are very soft. You can stand up there, put radar up there, grab rails all the way around. You know, uh, stereo is standard. Large gunnels all the way around, rod storage around it, tow rail. Uh, back here, if you want, you can put a uh, reversible chair just like that. Um, easily added on at the dealership. Live well and cooler box in the back, not skid all around the top deck so you don't slip and fall as you're walking around your boat. Pistons and gaskets on everything. Roll water wash down, fresh water wash down, second station. It's a nice little second station this year. You'll put a GPS up here if you wanted to, or you just look through the window and see your GPS, which we have nice, uh, you put it right in front of you, the GPS on the helm here. So inside the cockpit, you got two seats in the back here, and on the right, I do suspension seating, which is not offered by anybody else that I know of, on both seats. So, you know, pilot houses can be a little bit, you're, you're driving forward a little bit rougher ride, they say. The suspension seating will take a lot of shock out of it, it's awesome. Worth the money, in my opinion. It's an option, you don't have to get it. Uh, all the windows open up. I, I optioned the left side to open up as well. There's screens on our windows, which, again, the competitors don't have. We keep those green heads out of here. Um, nice, wide, large door to walk through for the bathroom. A real toilet in here that flushes, comes standard. This all covers in uh, the V-berth here. And uh, it's a nice little V-berth. I mean, two, three people could actually take a nap, sleep overnight if you wanted to in the canyon, whatever you want to do. So, let's take a look. We got two steps to get up to. Uh, I don't think any, a lot of people have that. So make it nice and easy to get around the walk, the uh, pilot house here. Here's the top of the pilot house where you can put your extra electronics like radar. Look at the fishing room here. My God, 9.6 beam fishing machine. Three ten guys on this boat. Go fishing. Uh, grab rails on the front, front hatch. Nice windless anchor. Comes stainless steel. You don't have to upgrade it. Many of the competitors give you a cheap plastic one that breaks constantly. Good luck getting more team done by them too. Uh, front windows that open up. Grab rails all the way around. 
So great boat. Give us a call, 732-505. Check out that fishing room. 3002 or log on to njoutboards.com for more information.